What's up, y'all? I just kind of do a quick read, and that's all. This is a real quick one. I'm not putting no clarifiers. I'm not even pulling out no extra cards. Why? Because I'm going to do another reading on this in about a couple weeks. So, I ain't got shit to do. So, I'm going to do this. Welcome to the Goddess Channel. Okay. Now, we want to talk about what well, I want to talk about. I don't know if y'all want to talk about it, but I'm just, I ain't got shit else to do but watch YouTube, okay? And um, I'm hearing, I'm watching all of these bloggers going back and forth with the artists, okay? So, as I'm watching into it, I'm like, let me just pull the cards out. I start pulling the cards out, don't none of the shit make sense. So, I'm going to clear it up for y'all. We'll do another read. So, let's go into Tasha K. The thing, the headline was Tasha K is broke. I don't see. Let's just say she, five of diamonds, she feeling a little left out in the cold, okay? So, Tasha K, Ten of Diamond, not going to work. The Joker. She don't have much. Okay. Here we are. Can't get diamond, but she getting to it. Okay. That's the joke. So, I don't know if you would say Tasha K is broke. But, um, let me see. Jack of Club, five of spades. Y'all see right here in your face. Jack of Club reverse. She not playing with how she working with things. She's actually winning, okay? She's not building much of a foundation, though. No. Okay, not at all. So here we are, two of hearts. She's still looking for ways how to do things. That's how she come up with this situation on Patreon. But she wasn't thinking as much. They, she damn sure didn't think they were going to turn it to her on the scam, okay? She was just trying to figure out how to build this foundation that she not doing because her ass ain't looking at the reality. If she already have haters, then the fuck you, they gonna turn your shit into anything. Who the fuck, cause she is need to look in the past. Who the fuck finna pay $15 for some information that's not even credible? Okay, so that that's why they call her a scam. Here we are, she was not fucking thinking. She chose to get into something, a union, reverse everything is fucking reverse okay so whatever she tried to do she didn't logically go within and think it out so i don't see what she gonna make no money off of that but she is winning now let's go into the reason she got into this is to try to expose cardi b now the thing is she's trying to say cardi b is broke let's see if Cardi B is broke. Six and nine and reverse. So both of them got to reverse that time. So she, Tasha not really feeling left out in the cold, of course, because she winning. Now, Cardi B may not have even give or take in her life, and she get into it. Hell, she have options. Come on, now. I don't have time for this. Here we are, being independent. I do what she, it, it's coming out where she has some even give and take, but she don't give a fuck. She not giving no type of feelings. To nothing right now. It's not going to be easy for her. Because she caring herself on how she working through things. She trying to stay focused right now. She got options. Keep coming up. She's passionate about what she's doing. So 
So, so far, I see where, of course, Cardi looked like she got more money than Tasha K. Okay, but Cardi don't give a fuck. She not even really trying to grow through this situation. She not looking at it for what it is. What it's saying, I guess why they calling Cardi B broke is because she... She, it's something that she did not even though she all passionate about it and she can't go forward with it it's something she did not look at within the situation that she's so passionate about that's by the time she come out of it it's just like fuck this shit so let me see she need to do some thinking ten of spades because she got a lot of building to do Jack of Diamonds. She not even want to play with it either. That's the joke. So, Cardi need to gain more. She's in a focus stage where she want to gain more, but it's going to be hard for her to do so because she's not really looking at the situation for what it is, but it's not a conflict. More so, like, because Cardi in the limelight, so it's not that hard for her to come up on something, but her being in her position, she could have more. That's what that's saying. So I don't see what um yeah, she not even heartbroken. She go going in the wrong direction, but not heartbroken because she don't give a fuck. That's the joke. Like I don't know what car to get her money yet. She needs to go within the thing. I don't see nothing nasty happening. She just happy. So, this not really, this just say she really focused on her stuff. It's not saying she got a whole lot of money. So, that's why they probably trying to call her broke. She just need to think more. But she not, she not giving up on how to get more money. That's what it is. Three of diamonds. She not collaborating either. She not being independent. Somebody backing her. That's how Cardi B got money. Yeah, it's not gonna be easy for her. She keep going. She got to go ask for motherfucking money. She got somebody is giving her some money. That's how Cardi B got money. We y'all giving her some money. I was gonna say we y'all heard it, but I really don't pay no attention to that. Now let's go into Armin Wiggins on this. So, like I said, we'll do another reading, but for right now, Tasha has the great potential of turning around, but point being, the way she doing her business ventures, the way she trying to set shit up, she gonna end up losing a lot. So, Armin B, he has an opportunity here. I mean, Wiggins, Armin B. That's the nigga's channel I watched, so. He popped up first. I had went to watch something else. I had to go back and find the headline and then end up seeing something else. Anyhow, so I don't even see why he's so passionate about shit. And it's just, uh, he playing how he go, like, things could be way brighter for him, but you know, he going. He moving along. I'd be so surprised how these cards come out. He's trying to stay, you know, passionate and strategic and just manifest his life. But he can have, he can have more too. He in the same realm as Cardi B. The difference between Tasha is she going to figure out a way, but that's her thinking path and this one that didn't lead her to no way um yeah i mean he not even fighting hard for his shit he just don't give a fuck he just gonna get it how he live he is okay with the little bit that he has if you want to call him broke <laughs> i mean it's 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 um to me this is all it's a little bit under middle range if you, I don't know how to try to explain that. See, he guarded because he can really could be making more somehow. Let me see. Uh, Queen of Diamond, yeah, he, if anything, he broke. Okay, so 
King of Spades because he don't think strate strategically on how to go get nothing. He not being independent, but he he just he love what he do. But he could do more. And he ain't even thinking about it. And it's like, I mean, he want to do more as a collaboration, though. But he probably guarded to that also. So it's, it's more afraid to do more. So that's, I can imagine where he falls short at. Yeah, because he just busy giving, but is he busy gaining? No, no even give and take. So, yeah, he, if anything, he'd have broke this out of all of them, of course, but... I don't know. They have a fight, and we're going to get into it in a couple weeks. Yeah, he just, he don't have no either give or take. He need to manifest more. This is what it is. The way he's manifesting is not much of nothing. He just guarded to it. It's all the way. He afraid to step out that box and do more. Well, or if he even can. I don't even see much of an opportunity. Maybe that's his karma. Although I don't really... Yeah, it's like he don't take an opportunity and he not going to be with the situation. Mm. Okay, that was enough minutes. Yeah, we out of here. I'm going to see y'all next time here on the 305 Goddess Channel. Love you. Later.